It's jailbreakist. For today's video, I'm going to show you how to jailbreak the new 3.1.2 software on your iPod Touch or iPhone. Note that this jailbreak works for all iPod Touches and iPhones, but if you're an iPod Touch 3G user, this is a tethered jailbreak. Tethered means that you will not be able to slide for power off. You can only tap the power button once, and so it will lock. If you do turn it off, you will have to plug into the program again and run it. And for all iPhone 3GS users, once you jailbreak with this, you will not be able to unlock again. So just bear that in mind. And if you don't accept that, continue. Okay. Now you guys, you need to download Black Rain. I will have links in the description for this. So download it. And this does not require LIB, USB, or any firmware. Okay. One more thing before we get started. If you are jailbroken already, like on the 3.0 software, and you're jailbroken on any other software, you're going to need restore and update in iTunes. So, just like restore with the 3.12 firmware, or just restore and update. Don't just update because that wouldn't be good because it would like leave City on there and then you jailbreak. I don't know what that would do. Okay, but if you are just a regular iPod Touch or iPhone user and you're on the 3.1.2 firmware and unjailbroken, then you're fine. You're ready to get jailbreaking. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is you're going to plug your device into the computer. Okay, and once it recognizes it, you're going to open up Black Rain. You're going to click Run, and then you're going to click Make It Rain. Okay, once you click make it rain, your iPod will automatically enter DFU mode and GeoHot will come up on the screen. So now it's really just a process of waiting. Now don't unplug your iPod or iPhone, just leave it plugged in. And just let Black Rain do its magic. This guy GeoHot, he's a genius. So now I have my little spinning bar down there. As you guys can see, this is very easy jailbreak, and it's very fast. Okay, my Apple has come up on my screen. That means that it is done, and now you can unplug it and exit out of Black Rain. So unplug your device, and exit out of Black Rain. Just waiting for a reboot. Okay, now I'm just gonna put my iPod back in its case because it's so much easier to show you guys for this part. Okay, it's not quite done yet. The jailbreak is not quite done yet. You still need to install Cydia and another thing if you want to. So when you turn on your iPod, you're gonna go to the second page, and for this part, you're gonna need an internet connection, and you're gonna see an app called Black Rain. Open up Black Rain. Okay, and there will be a list of three things, Rain, Rock, and Cydia. I have no idea what Rain is, but I do know about Cydia and Rock, obviously. Now, Rock is really fast. It's a lot faster than Cydia, and I really like it. And I'm going to get it, and I'm also going to get Cydia. So you can install one, or you can install both. And now it's just been installing. <clears throat> okay, now it's going to unpack rock, and then it will respring your iPod. 
Okay, so now it's respringing. And your iPod will respring again, and you can unlock it. And now you have Rock. It's identical to Cydia. So thank you for watching. Now you can again install us in whatever you want. Um, don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.